everybody. We have cookies. Meet on that. That one's a loading screen. If there's one untouchable in this business, it's Butcher Joyce. You put out a hit on some guy, Butcher flushes his body. No one's ever the wiser. Butcher knows everyone's business. But what keeps him alive is that he never, ever chooses a side. Yeah. Too bad there's a war coming. Automatically put the guns away. Blood. Oh, I heard you coming from a block away, Jackie. Look, look at him, he's awesome! I love Butcher. I think you sound like a fucking bull elephant. Generation. Every cop for a half a mile around probably knows you're here. Fucking cops all I need now, huh? Grab that body, would ya? True friends help you move bodies. <laughs> Yo! Friends oh, help you move. Real friends help you move bodies. Can't you people make your hits in a reasonable time of the day, I'm really sorry huh? I can hear that. Mm. That's the thunder. No, he told me there yeah, was only one body to dispose of. It just changed fish. Uh, oh. Food is being made. Deal is from the alley. Uh -huh. So what happened? Sadly, okay. there's no like actual like saving Good. in this to the extent um, where it auto saves so much. We'd have to start the game over again uh, if we want to get rid of that noise for you guys. So please bear with it. It'll be over uh, in a minute uh, or so. Just drop it in the trunk. I'll take care of it. I love Butcher's car. Look at this thing. It's the most discreet thing in the world. It's not flashy. Butcher's awesome. All right. Good enough. What happened to you tonight? Explain. Uh, I wish the hell I knew, Butch. I don't know. I guess Paulie thinks I'm gunning for his throne. Someone cold cocks me on a takedown at Dino's. Next thing I know, I got the 5th Italian Cavalry riding my ass. You know me, Jackie. I never choose sides. Whatever the problem is, it's... It's up to you and Paulie to solve it. Cookies! Uh, this gets out of hand in Chicago families will intervene. When that happens, buddy. You beat Paulie's guys, and he's not a good loser. Now, I wouldn't put it past him to throw Eddie Schroeder on your ass. Cops. Fucking cops. Ugh. Let's ask about the Chicago family. Hold on a second. Oh, there you go. Why would the Chicago families that. give a fuck? They care about two things. Respect and money. Not necessarily in that order. You make the money, you earn their respect. You rock the boat, they throw you in the ocean. They throw you mm. in the ocean. Now you listen to me, Jackie. Your only option is to take down Paulie before he takes you down. Put a big enough dent in his business, the Chicago people will see to it he has an accident. I would never be one to suggest how you do this. If you ask me, you need to pay a visit to Dutch Oven Harry. Put some holes in them. Hmm? Dutch so Oven Harry? <laughs> no, I've never heard of him. Who's Dutch Oven Harry? I'll tell you. Harry is Paulie's biggest dealer of illicit medicine. He works out of a building in Hunter's he Point. He weed, by the way. Now, if I were the kind of man to be involved in Whatever. things like this, take down off. Harry. I'd pull all of his merchandise out of the building. But I'm not, see? You don't want to come walking up to their front door. So go Wait, through that rundown down billiards club at Whitefish Alley. There's a back door leading to Hunter's Point from there. Hmm? I've been completely ah, sorry. I do apologize. Cops. This is why I don't get involved. Get back inside. So, we've got to go to Whitefish Alley. And then go to a rundown 
Because you can pull off the execution, but be careful of it. The execution takes absolutely no ammunition away, despite using bullets. That's weird. Yeah, it is, but at the same time, I'm not going to complain. I, I, I think they tried writing it rough, but, uh... No. Wrong. The best way to my Uncle Paulie's heart is through his rickets oh, with a new <laughs> Failing that, you screw up his Even distribution and let the Chicago people the collect on her. Now, I've been all over town picking up Paulie's drug money from the street peddlers, but I've never been to Dutch Oven Aries. It's chocolate. More chocolate. Okay, so I wonder if there's actually anybody that talked to you here. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Sure. Okay. Hypothetically speaking, would a moose right? have sex with me if I gave it ten million dollars? Would a moose have sex with me if I gave it ten million dollars? I kind of want well, to see this conversation, so but it would it? I guess it would depend on the moose. It's actually, oh, I, I can show you. It's actually, like the dark your head. eyes glow. And then, yeah. Okay, so we should actually probably... It looks like we should wrap it up here for time. Oh, oh, yes. That's not SpongeBob. Might as well be. No. <laughs> okay, that isn't even a square head. Okay. Same SpongeBob. SpongeBob is not a square. He's a rectangle. Okay, guys, we're gonna we're it, gonna it, leave it, this discussion off the video. It's irrelevant whether it's a video. square or a rectangle. Square either. They're also rectangles. The square pants is really just. I'm not even playing anymore. I'm just looking at you talking. Okay, well, bye, guys. Bye.